Russia's state gas giant Gazprom has agreed to separate gas shipments to Ukraine and the insurgent-occupied eastern regions of the country. That's according to an official representative of Gazprom, Sergei Kupryanov. During a press conference in Moscow, Kupryanov said that the shipments of prepaid gas to Ukraine will continue until the end of the week. This is when the short-term energy deal brokered by the EU last December is set to expire. He added that the shipments to insurgent-occupied areas will be treated separately by Gazprom. The news comes as European Union energy chief Mara Sefcovic invited Russia and Ukraine to Brussels to resolve the dispute over gas supplies to militant-controlled areas in East Ukraine on the 2nd of March. The vice president, uh, vice president, uh, response for energy union, Sefcovic sent letters to um, uh, Russia and uh, Ukraine inviting the Russian and Ukrainian energy ministers for a trilateral meeting uh, to Brussels on Monday, the 2nd of March, which is next Monday. Uh, we are now waiting for the final confirmation from, from the both sides whether they will participate. Earlier this week, Russia's state gas giant Gazprom threatened to cut gas deliveries to Ukraine within days as a result of Ukraine failing to pay for shipments of gas to areas controlled by Kremlin-backed militants. Gazprom has also warned that supplies to the EU were at a serious risk. EU expects that both Russia and Ukraine will stick to the deal agreed to on the 4th of December, according to which Ukraine was expected to pay 378 US dollars per 1,000 cubic meters until the end of 2014 and is expected to pay 365 US dollars in the first quarter of 2015. The temporary deal is valid until the 31st of March.